This video has been suggested from this comment. So remember to like and comment on my videos so that your song suggestion may become the next piano lesson. Also, only about 10% of you who watch my lessons are subscribed, so if you enjoyed or learned something from this video, please consider subscribing. It's free, and you can always undo it later. Anyway, let's get right into the lesson. Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play My Stupid Heart by Walk Off the Earth on the piano. I'll be teaching you how to play instrumental, so once you learn this, you can pretty much play, sing, and maybe improvise to it if you want. So it goes like this. Give you a preview before we start learning. It goes like this. Alright, let's go ahead and learn it. Melody and block chords, that's the foundation, and afterwards you can add your own improvisations like that to make your own version. But anyway, let's learn it. So right hand starts on the G. A, B, up to D, and then three E's, one, two, three, D, B. That's it for the first part, so we're breaking up the lesson to two parts, it's easy to learn. So let's learn it once again, so it goes G, A, B, D, E, 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 D, B. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have four chords here, the four chords are E minor, which is E, G, B, fully white note chord, and then G major, which is G, B, D, and third chord is C major, which is C, E, G, and fourth chord is back to G major. So as you can see, the, all these four chords are fully white note chords, so it's pretty easy to remember. So E minor, G major, C major, G major. Okay, in fact, you can actually just remember it just by just the first letter, and then it's like, skip note, white note, because all of them are white note chords, so it's easy. So it's just always like skipping a note for the chord. All right, but anyways, so that's that for the first part left hand. So E minor, G major, C major, G major. Practice those chords a few times. Un get it under your fingers so you remember it. So two hands together goes like this. So G and E minor together. B and G major together. E and C major together. B and G major together. That's it. Let's learn it once again. So it goes together, 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 together. That's it. Alright, Alright, second part, Brian continues, it goes D and then three E's, one, two, three, D and then B, and B, A, 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 G. That's it for the right hand. Let's learn it once again, so it goes D, E, 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 D, B, B, A, 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 G. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have four chords. The four chords are C major, which is C, E, G, and then G major, G, B, D, and then D major, D, F sharp, A, and then E minor. All right, finally, we have something that's not a fully white note chord. The D major is the D, F sharp, A. It has a black note in the middle there, okay? So with those four chords in mind, C major, G major, D major, and E minor, practice those a few times to get it under your fingers. Two hands together goes like this. So right hand starts on the D, E and C major together, B and G major together, a and D major together, G and E minor together. That's it. Learn it again. It goes together, 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 together. And that's it. So back to back, the two parts we've learned will be played like this. Repeat. And there you go. So once you get the melody and chords of it's all good, you can just play and sing to this version. Or if you want to be more ambitious and just make your own improvisations, you can. So left hand, you can do like octave of bass and then arpeggios. Rhythmic patterns. That kind of thing, okay? And right hand, you can harmonize on the chords to so play around. And there you go. So that's pretty much it. So hope you enjoyed this lesson, by the way. If you want to learn other awesome tunes like this, search up your favorite song name followed by Amos Stone in the YouTube search to find all those other lessons to learn for yourself. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, 
meme songs, video game music, movie, anime, and cartoon theme songs, and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.